Now it might seem like deja vu, but today I'm heading back to Hurricane. But this isn't just any other game. This is their derby match, the Classico, against bitter rival San Lorenzo. This is one of the country's oldest rivalries, and today we're going to see it firsthand. So stick around to see why a derby game in Argentina is like none other. Now a quick background in this Clásico. The first game between the pair was played in 1915 after both clubs had been formed in 1908. Since then they've played a total of 186 games against each other but that number will always have an asterisk mark against it as in 1997 a game was abandoned due to trouble in the ground. But out of those games San Lorenzo do have the better record. They've won 87 times. Huracan are a bit behind, to say the least, with 47 wins. The teams then drew 52 times. Now I'm going to be in a bit of a different area of the stadium today, and that's mainly because there are certain teams and certain games where in Argentina they don't sell tickets to non-members of clubs. That means the only ticket I could get was actually in another area of the stadium. But hopefully still it's going to be a good atmosphere, we're going to be able to capture some of, you know, give you an idea of what a Clásico is like in Argentina. And a message to the San Lorenzo fans, got a bit of stick in the comments for going to Huracan uh, in the last video. No, it's not that I'm avoiding San Lorenzo, it's just I literally got here on Tuesday, last Tuesday, and the way the games have fell is that there's been two at the Huracan Stadium. Now, I will get to San Lorenzo's ground at some point, so you know, don't kill me yet, don't kill me yet. Now before the match there's going to be what they call here La Previa, which is essentially just a party atmosphere that they have before the game. So there's not much more to say, let's head down to the Previa, let's head down to the game. Buzzing for this one, first Clásico in Argentina, let's see how it goes. <laughs>
Previ that was. You can just see the amount of passion the fans have here. Now let's get to the game. It's going to be unreal. confusion in the last minute really I mean the players were scrapping for like 
a good 10 minutes was like every time they went to take the free kick which had come from a foil which basically caused an argument between the players <laughs> they just kept going back and having another go but you know things like that in football I just I enjoy you know and um, well the atmosphere unbelievable from the previa the whole way to the recibimiento which is you know, the phrase they use here for how they greet the players and through the match like i said i wasn't in like the position i was in during the last game uh, because they didn't sell to non-members of the club that section i mean uh, but still a good atmosphere i did like how i was right beside a massive gate because this section here is actually meant to be for the away fans if they ever come to visit at the moment away fans aren't allowed in any games in argentina <laughs> so they use this area for bigger games like this other games they don't fill it but for big games like this there isn't much bigger than san lorenzo at home for them they use it and that's where i ended up today so i could have potentially got a bit further up but this isn't like Europe here, which is, you know, one thing I'm finding out is that once people have their spot, they stand and it's so steep that trying to get up is just next to impossible when everyone's crammed in. Like I'll pan around there, you know, I said in the last video. Now imagine trying to get up that while there's thousands of people there. So <laughs> yeah, but all in all, another brilliant experience at Huracan. Uh, once again, the San Lorenzo fans, I will get to your ground when I get a chance. If anyone wants to, you know, get me in with a ticket to that one, uh, that'd be brilliant. But once again, Hurricane, brilliant experience. Some shouts at the San Lorenzo keeper, you can probably hear. So, you know, it hasn't ended uh, in the most friendly of ways, but who would have expected that? But anyway, make sure to subscribe to the Partido. We're here for two months in Argentina making videos about football here. Not just the games, but also the stories behind football in this country. So make sure to subscribe. Drop a comment if you've got any uh, opinions on it as well. And we'll see you in the next video.